Well, here we are, making pizzas. <laughs> making pizzas for the big sale. <laughs> Trent. Trent. 
Where's your bicycle? Where's your bicycle? Happy birthday! Hi! Where's your tricycle? Where's your grandpa? Where's your bike? It's over here, Grandpa. Where's your bike? Go get on your bike. How old are you, Trent? No one here has forgotten the old Trent. Pull it. Trent, get on. Pull it. 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 Push and pull. Look at Grandpa. You two. Look. Watch out. Watch out. Kaboom. Be careful, Trent. It was kaboom, huh? Gotta look behind you before you start driving. <laughs> Say, Trent, you ran over me. You. Oh, Kelly. Big wheel. Hot diggity. Say, you ran over me. Trent's the big three. You go outside and get lecture from Grandpa. Oh, my shoes. Uh oh, the shoes coming off. Yeah. The people in that town who were there when the town was flooded still say. You want to put this together, Cole? Can you put this together? Yeah. Okay, sit down here together. See, my shoes coming off. Put it together for Grandpa. Coley, look at Grandpa. Say hi. Coley. 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 Oh, here. Well, put her on. Get up here and do this for Grandpa. Show Grandpa how you do that. They don't hit Coley, though. <laughs> <laughs> He's holding his arms still now. <laughs> so he's going to do it on the Coley. No, Trent. Well, you guys do it like this way, Coley. I mean, Trent. Trent. Do the other hand. There you go. Oh, he's doing it down. <laughs> He's about as coordinated as his mom and dad. Which is these two. No, he's the one who bent the garage door, not me. Grandma calls. Grandma Steve. Grandpa Steve. Grandpa Steve. Grandpa Steve. Oh, boy. I'm sorry, I should have waited for him to open up the door. Yeah. He's gonna say, oh, this? Is that what I mean? He needs some camp. He's got his shirt. Boy, what is that? All the way in Alberville. The men's 1500 meters, three and three quarters laps around the 400 meters. A staggered star with a full of three so how do I figure this one out now? No. no. <laughs> What is it? Complication. Huh? <laughs> he just looks at Grandma. Oh, got to say, you're going to make it. Oh, boy. Look at this. So he just throws it. Oh, shorts! Hey, Where's the battery? Must have been a hot day. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't. He's looking forward to the summer. That was. Yes, the heat's going to start. They wear, they wear those all winter long, have you not noticed? Yeah. I know. Yeah. It's cold. Yeah. 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 I know, they're guy was in Marine Corps. Yeah. 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 Ye
can make a wish. Wait a minute. Hi. <laughs> Wait, Grandma's got to get a flasher. Okay. Everybody wait. Um, you know candles. Up here. <laughs> ready to blow. Are you ready to blow? We're ready. Okay, you ready? Blow. Blow. Hey. Hot. 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 You don't want to eat the candles. He's licking them. Let's <laughs> <laughs> try that again. Speed skating event is. Uh, <laughs> I'm pull it right back in there. Because of weather, that's the second delay today. So we're going to head back to team yeah, for more of the get. men's competition in freestyle aerials. Here again, Greg Lewis and Park Small. Oh boy. Thank <laughs> you, get every little bit, Grandma. No, wait a minute. No, 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 no. We, we don't want to cut it. You want to cut it? Okay, Grandpa. We're going to shut off the light. Would you like to meet Jesus when he comes back? Yes. Wouldn't it be nice? Well, I'm glad you feel that way. And who is this? Do I know you? Come on over here. I know him. He's the guy that spent an hour trying to pick the lock on my car so we could get in. I know. <laughs> right? No, not really. <laughs> when was the last time I saw you? Just a oh, few days ago in Bakersfield? Yeah. Yeah. He was nice, huh? Well, I'll give you back to your dad. Are you going to be a good boy? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> He's going to be a good boy. All right. We'd like to present all three of these young people to Jesus this morning. But before we do that, I'd like to invite... We have some other special people here. We have grandparents. Are the grandparents here? Where are the grandparents? <laughs> grandparents here somewhere, don't we? Where are they at? Aha, let's have the great grandparents. We have grandparents and great grandparents. So we have four generations here. Come on up front here. Come on up here. We want to include you in this. This way, we can be sure that these children get the proper care. And we have some people to fall back on. If these children don't turn out perfect, we, we could blame them, but, it, but then they could turn around and blame you, and they could blame you, see, right? Because <laughs> everybody's involved in this. They're very special to us, and Jesus blessed them, the children, every one of them, didn't he? Even you, Mr. <laughs> so this morning, we'd like to ask our congregation if they wouldn't bow their heads with us, and we're going to ask God to especially bless these children and to bless their families, that God will use their fathers and mothers, grandmas and grandpas, and great-grandpas and great-grandmas, in a very special way to bless them. Shall we pray together now? Let's all bow our heads here. Heavenly Father, we bring these children before you this morning, because our rightful understanding of the scripture is that they really belong to you, that they have been given to us as your gift to us. And we are so grateful for the privilege. And we just pray this morning as a congregation that you will especially bless Troy and Yvonne as they raise Julian and Amanda and Trent. You know them and you know their needs. But we pray in a special way that you will also bless their grandparents and their great grandparents. Because every one in that family will have an impact in their lives. And we pray for the guidance of these parents and these grandparents and great-grandparents. That they will know exactly what to do. And that they will lead and bless and watch over these children. So we put them now at this time in your hands, dear Lord. We ask all of these things in Jesus' name. Okay, now we have something for you that's been prepared. I'm going to ask my wife to bring it up. She is my faithful guardian angel. Yes, you can go back to your seats. Okay. Yeah, and we have one here that's Jillian. And give that to, yeah, you give that to her. And this is Trent. And this is Amanda. Isn't that nice. Okay. 
Those had to be put away in a special place. Okay, you can go back to your seats. Thank you. being a special um, person in your life that might have helped you in your, in your decision to be baptized. Well, when is you, Pastor, and when is this wonderful church here in Tulare? They've been so thankful through the hard times with us and all that's been there. I've never found such a wonderful church in my family also, and my husband and my children. Thank you. It's the first thing in my life. Jesus. But Jesus works through people, doesn't he? And we're just thankful for all those different people you mentioned. You put quite a load on this church, though. Uh, are you think they're really as nice as you say they are? Yes, I think so. Yes. Oh, okay, all right. I won't argue with you. Sometimes I have my questions, though. <laughs> sure, is there anything you'd like to say to some special person or something? Um, well, I'd say six, seven years ago. My oldest brother, he started hitting me and probably the rest of my family go back to church. And I'm glad he did. Thank you for that. Now, is he here? Yeah. He's right over there. Jeff. Jeff. Jeff, would you stand up, please? I mean, we really want to, aha, now here's a fellow, his love for Jesus and his care for his family has led him to help this whole family back. Thank you so much, Jeff. We just appreciate the Lord working in your life. And we're so thankful for this day, for this village. Well, we have some special things. First of all, well, what can I say? They've already said that this is the perfect church. And since it's the perfect church and they're going to join it, right? We need to have an action now that we accept these young people into membership here in our wonderful fellowship. Is there a motion somewhere that we do that? Aha. Uh -huh. In motion, second right here. All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? Don't even speak. <laughs> okay. All right. See there? What happened now? Um, because of what you said, you're members of this church. And uh, so we'll expect a lot of things from you. So. Um, but we do have some special things. Now, Dolly, are you going to bring these up? We have some special things that we want to give you so that you will never forget this day. This is a very special day. And my private secretary here has been hard at work making sure that everything is, is taken care of. You have this book for who? It's for Troy. Troy Long. It says, Jesus said. And in this book are a whole lot of things that Jesus said about a lot of different things. And it's got your name <coughs> in gold letters on the front. And that's the best we can do. We don't have any gold crowns to give out yet. They're too expensive. But the gold letters on the book we'll have to do for now. And then on this side, we have for Iran a book, The Mother's Topical Bible. That's a special little Bible just for mothers. And uh, we know that you're going to be able to use that a lot. You want to have it. it has your name on there. Now, sometimes we give these out. Um, after the baptism, we do potluck. We'd like to invite all of our visitors to stay as much as possible. Sometimes we'd like to get people to sign those, put their names in there, so you'll always be able to um, remember those people that were there when you were baptized. And then to go along with that, we have some other things here. Now. What are those? These are baptismal certificates signed okay. and ready for membership. Okay. So now we've voted it, we've given you the certificates, we've given you the books. So we just have one thing left to do. So I'm going to ask if my wife will go back with Yvonne and tell you where to go. If you kids will go and get ready for the baptism, we're going to have a children's story and an offering. You've never seen a, a church service in the Adventist church where we didn't have an offering. So we're going to have a few things and special music. We're going to have those things. So. Just
as we were talking, there's one person who has really represented our church, Troy and Yvonne. And Yvonne said that she would like to say something about this special person. To Phyllis and Jess Eller, who have been wonderful friends, they, she has been there for me every time I needed someone to talk to. And this is um, what I say for her because she's my very special friend. And thank you for all the wonderful help you've given us. Thank you. When we think of winning souls for Jesus, Oftentimes we make it too difficult. Because I think of a brother who cared for his brother, for his family. As I think of uh, Sister Ellen, her husband. I have to say that this is the highest form of evangelism, to care for others. And this is the way Jesus really wins souls. Now because I've studied with you in Rome, and because I know you really love the Lord. But the devil doesn't give up easily. But that in the end, the Lord always wins. Because you've made a decision to commit your life to him. Because you want to be a mother to your children who will be loyal to Jesus and to raise your family to love him and serve him. Because you want to serve his church and you're part of the church. And because you want to be with your family in the kingdom of heaven. I now baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. you want to make a recommitment of your life. And you really want to begin your life with Yvonne. Again, being loyal to Jesus, serving Him. Because you want to acknowledge at this point in your life the forgiveness of your sins and the acceptance of Jesus again as your personal Savior. I now baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit.